gentlemen. Navroz Mubarak, and a very warm welcome to you all for our Navroz celebrations today. As we all know, a very revered member of our Parsi community in Delhi, Mr. Rustam Gai, passed away two days ago. And there was some thought of, you know, not holding this function as a mark of respect towards him. But then on second thought, we decided that we must carry on. You know, we must celebrate life. And even when we spoke with Mr. Guy's family, they were very clear that they would like the function to go on. Mr. Guy was a guiding spirit to our Anjuman for many years. He was the ex-law secretary of the government of India. And a lot of us went to him in times of legal advice uh, during our Anjuman rules, etc. I personally used to go to him. I remember he used to call me to his house when I first started attending federation meetings to give me knowledge about the panchayat in Bombay and you know a lot of other things. I have a small message uh, which his son Soli gave me to read out and I will read it the way it's written. So, you know, Soli asked me to read it uh, from my side, but I want to read it the way he wrote it. Dad was the most positive man I have ever met and he stayed eternally young by nurturing friendships with people of all ages. He didn't miss out on any opportunity to go out with us and especially loved going to Delhi Gymkhana Club, Costa Coffee. He led a full and active life and in fact decided to start traveling all over India with us at the very ripe old age of 87. So Soli told me that when, he, when his dad became 87, he read some article written by Tony Blair, the ex-Prime Minister of England, on Udaipur being a great city. And he decided that he wanted to go and see Udaipur. So from 87 till when he was about 95, for eight years, he went to Udaipur some three times. And then he went to Kashmir, he went to Shimla, he went to Kerala, he went all over the place. So that was a zestful life. He was a very spiritual and pious man and was known in Lodi Gardens where he loved his morning walk as the walking and praying priest. Temina and I, sure that God has given him a special place in heaven. His faith in God was truly unshakable and helped to support him even in his most difficult moments. I would like to say that dad was a man of great integrity and strong discipline. His personal and professional life, he was a dynamic law secretary and his law minister once said, Mr. Guy is like a an iron pillar. You can't bend him six inches to the left or six inches to the right. God bless you, Dad. We will miss you very, very much. Give us your love, blessings and friendship always. So that was a message that Soli wanted me to read out for his father.